It's a nice, cool, brisk, negative eight degrees here in Wisconsin, and we are picking up a brand new car. It's been a hot minute since we picked up a new car, so I'm super excited, and you can have my ass up at 7 a.m. in negative eight degrees to go get a new car. We've been waiting, all right? We've been searching, and I cannot believe we found the perfect car, and nonetheless, at, if you remember me in the 9-11 video that I filmed, uh, at Throttle Stop, all right? That's a really cool place in Wisconsin. And the last place I thought we'd find this car, just because they sell like Porsches, Ferraris, Lamborghini collector cars, and I hate to break it to you, that's not what we're picking up today. But in my opinion, it's just as good, if not better. So first things first, we gotta head up to old Lambo Field and get some cash. Not really Lambo, but close to there. And I'd rather just say Lambo than the bank. So let's go. Money is acquired and we are on our way to Throttle Stop. It's about an hour drive from Green Bay. And if you didn't know, we had two winter storms happen last week. And uh, the second one, Winter Storm Bennett, got pretty gnarly. It dumped a ton of snow. This is indeed going to be a historic storm. We literally almost got almost, I think it was a foot in Appleton of snow in one day. That's all gone now, which is good. However, it did make kind of this weird layer of ice on the roads. And with the super cold temperatures, if you didn't know, there's a point where like salt just becomes not effective against ice. Um, and in this negative seven degree weather right now, it's having trouble melting that ice. Good news is the Super has been doing good with the Viking Contact 7 winter tires on there. We're just taking it nice and easy because it's all back roads to get to the throttle stop. It's in a really small town, so there's no highways we can take. The good news is the car that we're picking up though, all wheel drive and I was super stoked to see it came with Continental DWS 06 plus tires, which is the exact same thing we're running on the Jetta right now. And I have been very impressed with those. So feeling confident, uh, Maya's gonna drive it on the way back and we'll see how she does, but we should be there real soon. This is so we embarked on our adventure, heading down the ice filled and snow filled roads in my rear wheel drive sports car headed to a small town in Wisconsin. The roads didn't really look bad in the footage, but all that hard snow you see is actually ice. It's super, super slick and got terrible as we were driving. I actually pulled over and I wanted to show you guys how bad it was, so I got the moccasins out and gave her a good old slide. So as a Wisconsinite would say, it was slicker than shit. But the super pulled through and we made it to throttle stop to find our new car. a 2017 Volkswagen Golf R. This is a one owner car, 50,000 miles, immaculate condition to the point where the entire thing is PPF. It was owned by an older gentleman who had immaculate taste. It has an APR catback exhaust with a valved remote. It has continental tires and N key wheels. It's the perfect start to what we are gonna end up doing with this car. We took it home and there was one important thing we had to do and that was get approval from our dog, Kai. She absolutely loved it. After being in the fetal position for 30 minutes and crying uncontrollably, Maya actually let me drive it. We took it to our favorite brunch spot and it was absolutely perfect. 
Getting here, a little quick review. We absolutely love this place. I celebrated with a Bloody Mary because I'm from Wisconsin. I got the Eggs Benedict because you can't go wrong with it. And dude, it was so good. This spot doesn't miss. But as we finished up and walked out the door, it started to hit me that we actually have a Volkswagen Golf R. And we're going to be taking this thing home and parking it in our garage tonight. I'll be doing a full review of this car, so make sure to subscribe, like, and comment if you want to follow along. And to get some words from Maya, she is a little bit shy on camera, but after prying and prying and prying, I did get this out of her. Do you like it? Yes, I love it. <laughs> now this car is so good, but there is so much that needs to be done to it. Thanks for being here.